Hey guys, welcome to my new video and today I will show you something very cool. This is Triple, new plugin for Blender. So it's a game changer. With just one click you can create 3D models. 3D modeling is now super easy. Triple is the best choice to make your work faster. In this video I will show how to create small park with Triple. Let's get started and see the magic. So guys, welcome back and first one, I'm gonna show official website and we can see what we can do here. We can generate 3D models in WebTripo and also we can see other features here and we can see all coming to your links here. Also plugins for Blender, Unity, Unreal Engine and Comfy UI. So today we will focus to Blender plugin. And after open Blender, go to Edit and Preference. So let's click this button and choose Blender plugin here and click here. Okay, right now let's click search button and go to here and click this checkbox for enable plugin. So after this, let's go to click here and we can see panels here with Tripo. And first use this 3D generator. We can use API key here and click confirm. I will add a link on the section below how to use this API key. So guys, interface is very user-friendly and we can create 3D models here with just one click. Also, we have two ways for create models. First way, text to model and next way, image to model. We can import here simple images and we can convert to 3D model. So first one, let's go to text model and I will create cartoon park and let's write here first text prompt, bench. And go to settings, we can choose here versions I will use last version, 2.5 version and for better models we can click this checkbox and enable quad mesh output and use custom face limits and we can use face limits here, I will keep default and style and we can choose here styles, original styles or cartoon or clay and I will use cartoon style and go to click generate ok, let's wait for generating Ok, here we go, let's select this model and zoom in here. Ok, very good. And we can see character here sitting on bench. And let's click here for see with shading. Ok, very beautiful and quality textures, I like it. And let's change this name bench character. Ok, that's good. Ok, let's create the next model. So also we can use advanced settings here and we can check or uncheck texture and PBR materials and texture from original image and texture standard or detailed and auto size and orientation align image. So let's close these settings and go to again text prompt. Let's write here cute dog and let me show this enable negative prompts we can write here negative prompts or enable pause control let's click here we can choose pause here and t pause or a pause also ledge body and arms body we can choose these settings and let's uncheck here i will use default settings and after write this text click generate okay next model here and we can see very quality textures and model very good go to scale button and change scale nice and let's go to add and cylinder and let's open settings and change and dip okay so let's add other models here and right now I will use image to model let's click open and select this image and click load image from path and before generating I will choose again style to original style and click generate okay here we go let's move to left this model and very nice let's press S change scale and move to right like this so select these two models, let's move to left a little bit. Okay, we can check this model textures and all details. Very quality, I like it. Okay, let's go to again image to model, let's click open and choose this carton tree, click load image, again style, original style and let's click generate. Okay, here we go, our model is ready, let's move to left and press S, 
chain scale and moved up like this. Okay, very cute and sweet scene. I like it. And move to back and also shift D. And let's for duplicate, move to here. And let's chain rotation like this. So for final, let's add flowers here. Again, let's go to click X and import image here for generating image to model. Let's click open, choose flower, click load, and again, click generate. Also, don't forget to choose style, original style. Click generate. Okay, nice. And let's press S, change scale. Okay. So let's shift D for duplicate, move to here and change rotation our scene is ready and we can render or we can export this scene after effects with using elements ready let's go to render settings and choose render engine cycles and device and denoise let's enable also go to film and click for transparent background and go to click this icon for world and for add environment image or lighting let's click this color and environment texture let's click open we can choose any environment images here i will use sunrise and click open image okay let's click this icon for see report shading okay very nice I like it, this cartoon style and this character textures and these models. Okay, so let's export this scene After Effects. For export, let's go to File and Export. And let's choose here Wavefront OBG. And let's export Wavefront OBG file. So let's open After Effects and let's right click New and Solid Layer. Add name Element 3D and click OK. Let's go to FX, Video Copilot, and Element. Let's click Scene Setup, Import, and choose 3D Park, and click Open. And don't change any settings, click OK. OK, here we go. We have model here, but not any texture here. Let's add textures. First one, let's go to Blender and export all textures. So go to here and right click. Let's vertical split and let's go to choose shader editor and select this first main character and we can see textures. We can export all of them textures and I will use only base color. Choose this image and we can see this icon, unpack item. Let's click here and choose this first unpack. We can see exporting here. Let's change name character then let's choose this dog and again click this icon and click here and change texture name dog in this time let's back to elements 3d and open inside select this first character let's see okay and let's turn off normal texture and go to diffuse let's click here and click color for import image and in this folder texture folders choose character and open okay here we go we have C texture is working like this and let's choose this dog and go to again turn off normal and color choose here dog and open let's see okay very nice and let's enable show ambient or collision for realistic shadows. Nice. And select this swing model and turn off normal and color. Color here and texture. Let's choose swing, click open and click OK. And another model, cartoon tree and turn off normal, color and texture. Let's choose texture 3, click OK. Very nice. And the last one, flowers. Choose flower and turn off normal and click color and texture. 
choose here flower texture click ok nice so select this material for green and change glossiness for matte texture okay and go to presets environment backlights and let's choose backlight for better lighting or try this okay that's good and also can try these light styles let's try 100 ambient okay this is very good cartoon style click ok and in this time let's create new camera tool right click new end camera and press it 50 millimeters click ok and press c or we can control these buttons and let's zoom to like this and let's select these elements ready let's open render settings and let's lighting and choose here again 100 ambient and for shadows open ambient occlusion and enable nice very good we can choose here intensity for example six or three okay that's good and let's create rotate animation okay so in this time let's go to world transform and world rotation we can change rotation like this let's create y rotation keyframe press u for c only active keyframes and go to six seconds select work area and change this one let's see okay that's good so let's add default field select camera let's open inside camera option and enable default field and aperture let's choose here 100 and change quality for now quarter and change fox distance nice and aperture let's change this 60 or 80 and blur level 200 okay that's good we can play settings for better results let's see nice very good and for background let's select these elements already go to render settings and physical environment and show in background let's change quality quarter okay very nice we can choose color here let's choose blue let's see okay very nice I tried the triple AI plugin myself and honestly I was surprised. It turned out a simple image into the usable 3D model very fast. It saved me a lot of time, especially when I need quickly product models or concept objects. With Trupo, we can create cartoon animation series, kids animations, game assets and more. It's real game changer tool for build your animation dreams. I recommend you Tripo, absolutely you can try it now. So if you want to try it too, you can check the link in the description below. You can visit with Tripo web or you can get the Blender plugin and start now. And with Tripo AI, you can really speed up your 3D workflow. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video, leave comments and have a good day. Good luck.